Now welcome to another edition of News from Naboo with the worst lightning takes. And let's get right to the news. Alright, we just kind of got an interesting rumor that's out there now. That uh, Tales of the Jedi Season 2 may not be what it seems to be. So when Dave Filoni even announced that we were going to get a continuation, that we were going to see more of the Tales of the Jedi, yeah, he kind of left it like a little open-ended saying, yeah, yeah, we're going to be getting more. And we saw already on the schedules that are out there, the ones that are like still TBD, because we don't have dates for anything, said Tales of the Jedi Season 2. Rumor has it that the series is expected to expand to Sith and Bounty Hunters. So your fun prediction about Tales of the Sith might be true. It might be true. Not to mention Tales of the Bounty Hunters. So how big is this then? Well, nobody knows as of yet. It could be interesting because they could like continue our Count Dooku story to perhaps give us some more tales of when he had changed into a Sith. Sure. I'm just wondering if this will be a little bit more expanded then. Well, part of what I'm wondering is perhaps when they put Tales of the Jedi Season 2 as the, like, on there on the schedule, title? could that be, yeah, a working title? And surprise, surprise, like a week beforehand or whenever they release the trailer, they'll be like, and Tales of the Sith. That could be cool. Or yeah, they could they... just do whatever, you know, or Tales of the Bounty Hunters or mm-hmm. whatever. They could just have multiples of these. We talked about really them before. Like, like there's that, no, yeah. no reason not to just put little, you know, kind of shorts up from time to time. Maybe even a couple times a year you get these kind of Tales of the Jedi or Tales of the Sith or Tales of the Republic. Yeah, because currently it just looks like it alternates years with Star Wars Visions, which obviously we can't verify 100% unless we get another Visions next year. But I'm really hoping that this rumor is true. I really would love to see an expansion on the stories. There's only sure. so many Jedi stories that I need told. Well, in a way, Dooku was already a Tales of the mm-hmm. Sith. <laughs> kind of. But I want to see this happen. I'd love to see more tales, more stories. Really would look forward to hearing Tales of the Sith because obviously most of the stories that we get, the perspective we get is from the Jedi, from our good characters. So it'd be it's interesting to see... Uh, I would tell you. That's why they're Tales of the Sith. Yeah. Oh my god, that could be the intro. <laughs> Not a story a Jedi would tell you. Tales of the Sith. Could you imagine it's narrated by... Oh, Palpatine. Palpatine himself. He's Ian McDermott's gonna yeah. tell us a story about the Sith. That would be really, really cool. I mean, I that's not what the first season the... of Tales of the Jedi was, but no. you can lean into it for Can you imagine this. getting a Tales of the Sith story and seeing what he did to his master? That Seeing could him be with Plagueis? Yeah. We could actually... <laughs> See the I would love story to see of Plagueis the Wise. Tale- <laughs> Have you ever heard the story? Well, would you rather watch it instead instead of listening to me tell you? Oh. No, I, I think that's I think that's something that's kind of fun and cool because mm-hmm. you don't oftentimes get uh, from the Sith perspective their right. stories. Right, we're not supposed to empathize with them. No, yeah, I'm not saying you're supposed to. I'm not implying that's but what it would do. But interesting. Yeah. To see what they were doing behind the scenes. Yeah. I mean, we, we've had some stories. I mean, Plagueis is a fantastic book. Obviously, mm-hmm. that's the story of Palpatine and his master and, and even before that. So Yeah. I feel like Tales of the Bounty Hunter could be more cool in terms of action, but might offer less in terms of, like, canon story lore. Well, that's fine. It is. It is. I'm I just mean, that's saying. What, as I've said before, Book of Boba Fett should have just been a fun... I mean, if there was could've ever been. a time where you didn't need a whole lot of plot and you were looking for a lot of fun and action, it was, that was the it. Book of Boba Fett. <laughs> <laughs> and yet instead you had the book of sand on Tatooine. Well, yeah, the book of I'm going to Everything gonna... moves slowly on Tatooine. <laughs> Too slow. I'm the Daimyo. My name is Boba Fett. Such a weird decision. <laughs> it was so show. weird. Kenobi's going to gallivant across the stars, yeah, but Boba, Boba Fett, gonna he's stay on he's going to stay right there. Uh, what were they thinking? <laughs> But anyway, no, I, I'm cool with expanding this idea mm-hmm. of having these shorts and in the Clone Wars style animation. Absolutely. But speaking of Tales of the Jedi, what kind of stories would you like to see this season? Like, what character specifically, if there's a volume two of The Jedi, what Jedi would you like to see? I've got, like, four, five written down that i really like to see. Not Ahsoka? <laughs> None of them I love Ahsoka. Ahsoka. Well, I, I feel so is. bad when I'm like, I don't want any more Ahsoka. I'm such a huge <laughs> fan, but it's like, okay, pump the brakes a little on Ahsoka's story. Let's get somebody else in there. First up, I want Luke and Ahsoka's meeting. In animated I, well, style. I just said not Ahsoka. Yeah, but I want their meeting. The okay. story we didn't get is the story I want. It would almost be better in animation to have Ashley be. Eckstein doing it, I think. I'd, I'd ra- no offense to Rosario no. Dawson, but I think I'd rather have that done with Ashley and mm-hmm. Mark Hamill in the booth as well. That could be awesome. That'd be fantastic. Yeah. You know, he just finally met Natalie Portman at the Golden Globes. I saw that, yes. yes. He met his uh, mo- How I Quote, Met My Mother. Quote, unquote, mother, yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I would love to see their first meeting. 
Um, another Jedi story I'd love to see. I want to see Shakti because I just want to Which know how one? she finally goes down. She's got so many stories. I'd rather it just always be vague. How no, she actually I want died. to know how she actually goes down because she could have gone down like eighteen different have ways. Have the always story of the death of Shakti? No, because Which she's one? Not, she's not dead. <laughs> she's probably still I'm alive. Not dead yet. <laughs> You're horrible. Some, well, someone will get that reference. Next, Barris Offie. Yes, I that, that could be tales of the Sith. It could be uh, both, honestly. Jedi, yeah. I want to know what swayed her. Like, you know, I want to know more the, about the BS. I think that's what swayed her. Yeah, I think she saw through the BS. What if there was some sort of like Palpatine in the background, still like talking about the you know Jedi and their role? And I don't think the, I don't think it's like, impossible. Somebody motivated her to, mm-hmm. to like see. maybe he planned on making her his Inquisitor. Maybe she is an Inquisitor. I mean, everybody assumed she'd become one, right? I mean, we didn't think she actually got like, never executed given her, for treason, I mean, they were right? so close with fourth sister, I thought. Could yeah. this? No, it's not. That's what everybody thought. And then we saw the one in uh, Kenobi. And we're like, oh, is that? No, no. 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 <sighs> I don't know. Don't know what happened to Barris, but I'd love to. I'd love to know what happened to Barris. It seems like there is a story there, yeah. Next, Cal Kestis. A Cal Kestis that would be, animated That would be version. interesting to see I mean, him in animation. I mean, he kind of animated in a game, right? Yeah. But not, a, not the same thing. To see more of his story, especially if they do plan. Like, we've heard rumors that they plan to bring him to live action. Why not? I why mean, not? So then the people who don't play the games, why not have some shorts of Cal Kestis? I'm cool with that. They could have some shorts leading into the games from the beginning rather than... Yeah, I don't know about that. Because he's kind of just... You know? He's trying to... He's pulling a cane in at that point. He's trying to keep it on the down low. So you're right. You're right. I don't know how exciting. I mean, it's not a terrible idea. But I just wouldn't mind them maybe animating some of the story we saw with him and his master yeah. from the first game. That could be cool if you wanted to do that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I thought you meant like kind of between Order 66 and when we see him in the game. No, that'd be cool. No, with... kind of leading up to maybe his early Padawan days. Sure. Leading into what happened in the game in the Order 66 that he went through. Yeah, that'd be fun. Kind of gives you a little segue into who this character is. This could even help game sales. Yeah, it couldn't hurt, right? Couldn't hurt. Last but not least, I want Ezra. Tales of the Jedi Ezra. What ten years happened? On, ten on years the, with the yes. pod people? That's what we call it. <laughs> post purgle <laughs> post purgle yes. post purgle pre-pod? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Well, I want to know what happened to him when he got to, you know, the other you P know, place. <laughs> Timothy Zahn has said he would tackle that 10 years. He would. So I, I, I believe he, he said that. I, I don't entirely quote him. But then we'd that. get I'm it from sure Zahn's perspective, him. most like. Well, well, yeah, of course we would. But my, <laughs> my point is if anybody could find a way to make sense of whatever whatever was going on for that 10 years and why Ezra wasn't hunted by Thrawn and all of this... It's Timothy Zahn. It is. It is Timothy Zahn. Yeah. But no, I, I, I guess. I mean... But a Tales, to, Tales of the Jedi, Ezra Bridger would be really cool. It would have been more cool if, like, the rumors about him, like, learning this, like, special new technique mm-hmm. from this old master, and I don't mean old master Maul. I feel but... like he was still trying to actually just impress Sabine. Really? You think that's like, what he was like? I don't need my saber was... back. I gave it to you. I'm I'm super good. Yeah. I'm awesome. I'm good. And then he's push. like, five force minutes push. later, he's like, just... I'm just going to make it. I mean, he's a blaster. I'm, I'm Maybe she won't notice. No, yeah. he, he, oh, and then he made a new one. But, I mean, <laughs> like, in the fight, he's like, like no, you keep that. I, I, you know, I don't need I don't it need anymore. It. I don't need it. I know I'd use blasters now. Which I, I think he was before. trying to show up like, look, I'm still, I'm cool. I'm still mature. He was I'm... force pushing. Like, he wasn't doing anything I know. like, uh, I know. like cool, different. Like, no, he just like force No pushed. force karate. And then, like you said, he made a new lightsaber anyway. So it's like, all right, whatever. I feel like in that moment, he was like the old Ezra trying to show off, like, look, no, I'm fine, I'm well, fine. I don't it need had my... been a good 10 years since he probably <laughs> saw a young lady. So, <laughs> let alone a you young know, lady he had interest yes, in. Yes, yes. But I would love to see a Tales of the Jedi Ezra. No, I'm, I'm okay with that. Is there anybody else on the, that I've left off the list? Anyone you'd want to see? Maybe someone more subtle, someone more obvious, perhaps? Ooh, subtle or obvious. I mean, obviously, there's Luke. I don't know about obviously there's Luke. Obviously there's Luke. I don't know what you do with Luke because mm. I just don't know what you do with Luke in general. Like, yeah, you can bring him in for the Mandalorian and he can do cool stuff, but like in terms of story. Because we know where his story went, they kind of murdered him. Well, he kind of murdered himself. He forced too hard. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Who would I like to see in the Tales of the Jedi? Let's do Quinlan Voss after the Clone Wars are Ooh. done when he's doing whatever the hell he's doing. Right. Because we know he. Yeah, yeah. Kenobi confirms he's alive and part of the path and doing stuff. He might stuff, have been so. one of the founders of the path for all we know. Probably, yeah. That would be a really cool story I'd like to see. Yeah, I'm down for that. Some of the Jedi founding the path, maybe. Maybe some of the Jedi on the path. Yeah. 
that'd be really cool to kind of get some more Order 66. Here's what the surviving Jedi were going through. Yeah, I mean, we don't want to add too many more <laughs> to the list of survivors. Even though, the, in theory, like, I know there's a debate about how many would have actually survived and how many had died mm-hmm. already. I'm sure several had survived, right? A good number survived the initial mm-hmm. clone attack. But you don't want too many, because then it kind of just muddies the It really depends the on how many... <laughs> How many clones they were by when the order well, went out? Exactly. Like that that's the thing. Like not every Jedi was gonna be like next to a clone trooper in a, a compromising situation, right? With his back to him like charge, like yeah, trooper, movie, I'm and, going like, to be using yeah. the refresher. <laughs> Execute order sixty six. My, well, my Jedi Master is executing <laughs> Order 2 right now, so I'll get right on that. It's real easy. Anyway, I don't, I'm don't. i sorry about that one, but uh, yeah, I, I'll take I'll take a, a Quinlan boss. I've always liked him, so and yeah, he's I, kind of, a, you know, he's a more edgy Jedi, mm-hmm. and he's probably doing some cool stuff at the time, like so. I feel like Qui-Gon would be really cool to see, but we got some... We got that a little bit, yeah. And we're going to be getting a little bit more of him in the upcoming... Well, Mace Windu's doing his yeah, special mission. the Glass or Abyss, which is at the Glass Onion. I got one last request, because we were always such good friends. So Clearly. Good. No, because they weren't good friends. You wanted yeah. him to see what he had seen. <laughs> you have not seen <laughs> what I have seen, Master Windu. And once you do, it won't change anything, because we know how it all goes anyway. Yes, because that movie is done. Yes. Baked in, we're finished. Yeah, we're good. We're good. And, and we're good. So that's going to be all we got for this time. Now it is your turn to take to the comments below. Tell us who you would like to see in Tales of the Jedi Season 2, or who you'd like to see in uh, Tales of the Bounty Hunter, or Tales of the Sith. Whatever the case might be, leave those comments below, let's talk some Star Wars, and until next time, thanks for watching.